My name is Carlos Puertolas, but uh, you know, in the drone community, I'm, I'm known as Chapu. It's almost like a superpower, is this, this complete freedom of movement. I'm not a really competitive person. I don't like to have that feeling like, oh, I want to beat this guy. I prefer just enjoying and the kind of like freestyle of it. When I was younger, I used to do a lot of extreme sports, a lot of skating, snowboarding. 10 years ago, I had an injury climbing and I completely broke my leg and I had a few surgeries on my leg. So I wasn't able to kind of do those things anymore. I discovered uh, drone FPV flying and slowly I realized that I was getting that same adrenaline by doing this without the danger. It feels like an out-of-body experience and it, it almost feels like you're inside a completely different animal. You're not a human anymore. I've been doing the drone stuff and posting videos online probably for a couple of years now. I never got so much attention. It's, it's, it's pretty amazing. I never expected anything like this to happen. We were flying today. It's a little dangerous. Why? Because there's a lot of metal. I got stuck right there. Let's see if I reach. It's the problem with frequency, you know, and the interference that all of these metal bars create. The view that I can see on my goggles sometimes gets a little fuzzy because of all of these metals, and it creates lines. God. Ah, idiot. Yeah, the camera is fine, everything is fine. A little kink here, like... This model is not going to be the same, but it's fly. Well, I'm here. This is a little scary. They're not toys, you know. There's a motor in it that spins really fast. It has four propellers that spin really fast. So obviously, if you put your finger in the middle, it's going to cut you. So it's important to know, you know, it's, it's important to kind of respect it. The quadcopter that I fly is called the Charpu X, completely designed for my taste and it flies really amazing. It's amazing to go to events and have everybody kind of stopping you and saying like, hey man, thanks so much. Because of your video, I start flying. But every time I hear that, it just it makes you want to fly more. I definitely see it as an art form, as a way of recording something that is not easy to see, something that you don't see every day. All right. A way of seeing an environment in a completely different perspective.